Yes, YouTube, what is good? And welcome back to another video here on the channel. It is a massive video. First of all, we're gonna be talking about what team I'll be signing for the upcoming season, behind the scenes of a new business that I've started, even though I really do hate using that word, and tons of tips of recovery. We're midway through a bank holiday weekend, which means I played a game yesterday and I've got another game tomorrow within 48 hours of each other. So, recovery, ice baths, plenty of food. And by now, you all know the drill. We document our journey as a footballer, as an athlete, as a person, the ups, the downs, signing pro contracts, being released, suffering crazy injuries, trying to become the best athlete we can be in the gym, outside the gym. So if you haven't already, lads, drop a like, subscribe, and let's get into the video. So today's video, we have like five or six goals that we have to get done. Number one, recovery. Bank holiday weekend means two games in 48 hours. So we're going to go through the level leap mobility session and recovery session at the gym. Number two, refuel, making sure we're getting the right foods, enough protein, carbohydrates. Number three, the ice bath. Dreaded, but really, really important and useful. Number four, persuade the missus to give me a full body massage again helping with recovery number five talk about a new business i've set up and i want to announce to all of you showing you behind the scenes of how i run things and how i'm beginning that journey and number six to announce the club i'll be playing for this season that being said let's get into the gym session So I'd now like to introduce today's sponsor, Emma Sleep. So with all my training and just how my body will feel at the end of a hard day, I've just been really struggling to get comfortable and get a consistent night's sleep. But around 10 days ago now, Emma Sleep sent me through one of their high quality mattresses. And with the aid of sleep experts, I can't lie, it has been a real game changer for me. All right, so lads, we've just put in the new mattress. Can't lie, first impressions, very, very comfortable. And it just has that luxury mattress feel. What's in this? I've always known how important sleep is for athletes, but I've never looked into actually upgrading my mattress. We don't need you anymore, you uncomfortable thing. But once I started looking into Emma Sleep, I just knew that this was an upgrade that would change everything for me. Now in all seriousness lads, I can't lie, this mattress has generally been a bit of a game changer for me. I think the jump from the old mattress being so poor to this one obviously being high quality with the use of sleep experts to make sure you can get the best quality sleep. I don't know, just as a footballer, you know when you have like really tight hips, your legs are a bit achy after a game. I can generally never get comfortable with my old mattress but this one it just feels so much better and I am actually feeling the differences waking up in the morning after weeks and weeks of tough training. Honestly, we also offer a 200 night risk free trial and a 10 year guarantee on your mattress. So go to the link in the description. Emma Sleep are doing a massive discount right now with up to 55% off. Plus, if you use my code, you can get even more money off your spending. Big thank you again to Emma Sleep for sponsoring the video and genuinely a really good product. Really enjoying this right now. Physique update. Baby, you're gonna pop. You get on your head. It's not the problem. Oh my god, it is. It's, it's, it's cool. freezing. We've done this before. Oh, maybe I should just get out and just pretend I've got it. I'm only joking. Lie down. Calm. Breathe. Jesus God. 
Yeah, I agree, bro. Should have a heart attack, mate. Heart attack. This is cold now, I can't lie. But we're gonna stay in it for 10 minutes. There's a few reasons why we're in the ice bath right now. Firstly, of course, the obvious one, it does help recovery. Two games in 48 hours. But secondly, I did get absolutely clamped. I've got like a real bruised calf and like foot almost. So staying in here is gonna help the injury a little bit or the bruising. 10 minutes in here, continue to fuel ourselves the right way with the right food that we're going to speak about. I'm going to go for a little bit of a walk, talk about the team I'm signing for and also just get the blood flowing in our legs and hopefully we'll be good to perform for tomorrow's bank holiday game. Look at all these just big clumps of ice and a lot of them just melted. We've got a tuna melt from Subway's. We ate half of it earlier, of course carving up because we've only got a 24 hour period to our next game. We're gonna just heat this up and eat this after the ice bath. Right, we just quickly got dressed after the ice bath. My legs are still freezing. We got our little heart of six inch sideways. I'm literally gonna get into bed. We're probably gonna chill it, eat some food, do some work. We've also got some little volt along rubs, which we're gonna put on where we got absolutely collided. Uh, hopefully, I don't know if it's going to make a difference, but we're just going to rub it on there after the ice bath. See what happens. Volta old paintings. See this bit of your calf, like someone came in behind and it's just like tender. So we're going to put some of this Volta on, see what happens. Kind of comes like up into this bit of the calf as well. It's like all down here. So about a week ago, I announced the beginning of the Levely Academy. Something I've been working on for a while now. And here on the channel, I wanna kinda of share the behind the scenes of setting up my own business, running the business, looking to improve it. Things that people don't normally share, the ups, the downs, yet again, similar to what I've done in the past with my football journey. I've always been a big believer in going after what you want. I went from being a professional footballer, having a gaming YouTube with like 300,000 subscribers, a Twitch streaming channel of like 80,000, stopping all of that, and now of course making these videos the football fitness videos and now of course the Levely Academy we announced about a week ago a brand new business if you like really hate using that word now the inspiration behind Levely essentially comes from myself being at a professional academy having all the sports scientists coaches nutritionists all these different people creating a structure and a plan for you to follow and as a footballer all we had to do is turn up and give 110 percent everything was set up for us to succeed we'd cover all the areas needed to as footballers but levelly is for the ballers that either aren't in those pro setups or have come out of those pro setups pro academies and want to train just like these pro and elite players do with gym structure, training structure, weekly schedules, nutrition plans, educational workshops. There's so many different things involved in the academy. You're better off just going to watch the video on the link in the description and checking it out for yourself. Now finally, as we come to the end of this walk, I would like to talk about the team I'll be signing for next season. Some of you have been in my DMs and you've worked it out. I've played a couple games for this club already. You'll be seeing my first highlights, hopefully pretty soon for the club. But the team I'm gonna be signing for is Leyston FC. The club plays at step three level, the league I've already been playing in. Last year they finished third after a really good season and got very, very close to being promoted, losing out in the playoffs and actually were at the top of the table for quite a while during the season. I know a lot of the lads there, as a lot of them are from the Norwich area, which some of you will know that I've been living around that area for quite some time now. And just seeing the players that have gone there, that have now moved on to higher levels, knowing the management again from being around a similar area to me, knowing what they're all about, it's definitely going to be a club where I'm gonna enjoy my football. They look to play really, really good football, which I know sounds silly, but if you've played non-league, step three, you'll know some teams don't always play the prettiest football, which for attacking players isn't the best of playing week in, week out. That being said though, I've waffled on quite a lot there. Uh, we're nearly home, so we're gonna get in, continue recovery, fueling ourselves, and uh, move forward to the game tomorrow. So let's get it. <laughs> Grab it now. It's um, working, isn't it? Yeah, other side. Hey, oh, I'm sorry about that one. That's disgusting. Where's the f***ing romance gone, bro? I'm not, I, I want to be at one of your games when you like, score for the first time there. Yeah, you don't even come there. I come all the time. Babe, why are you being annoying? I'm joking. Last time I had to f***ing... Sorry. It's part of the job. 